So my interest was piqued about two weeks ago when I received this product in the mail. And of course, I am talking about the temp spike. So look, I've received two products here from competing companies, and I can tell you from where my shack is located to inside my house, none of them reached. That said, this one supposedly reaches up to 500 feet which will be well within the boundaries of my house. So I am real interested to see how it does. Now look, man, this video here is gonna have very low production value, man. I wanna keep it all about the temp spike. And of course, a little, uh, little New York strip from Porter Road. And look, as you can hear behind me, I do have my uh, Z grills all fired up. And I am gonna also use the uh, sear plate, I think on my monument grill that is infrared sear i want to see how that works we shall see other than that let's get the uh, steak over to the board let's open up this temp spike and let's start the show So guys, look, right off the bat, I want to say how easy, how easily this sucker was to hook up to my uh, cell phone. Sometimes, as you guys know, that is half the battle. You're going to get a 500 foot ultra long range. That is Bluetooth 5.2, which makes this truly wireless. You're going to get one probe, two sensors. One will read your internal meat temperature and also the other side, the top, will read your ambient pit temperature. It's going to have a, a smart alarm, rechargeable, waterproof. This should last three months on one charge. I mean, there is a lot to offer for the small price that you pay. So we are going with the classic salt, pepper, granulated garlic. Look, if you're not mixing your own mix of at least salt, pepper, and garlic to keep up in the cabinet, I'll leave links down below. You could purchase the bags directly from Amazon, mix your own, keep it in a jug, and you are good to go. So look, the only thing with this thermometer is it's got a little line on it. You see it right there. You just got to get that inside the meat, and you are good to go. All right, guys, so look, that's basically all there is to that. I am centered and I am past that line. And I do have my uh, Z grills fired up to that super smoke setting. So again, the plan here is I'm going to bring this up to about 105, 107. It is not the thickest piece of steak in the, uh, in the world, but it'll do. I'll bring it up to that, uh, that temp there. I'm going to monitor it from in the house. I mean, that is the whole show right there. And as long as everything checks out, I'll meet you over at the uh, Monument Grill where we will light up that infrared sear plate and sear this puppy off. Oh. Guys, this is your typical reverse sear. Keep the pit under 200 if you can. Get as much smoke on the meat as you can and take it to your desired temperature. All right, guys, look, man, as, uh, as those of you who follow my show know, I am sitting in my office and I am real excited about this. Has ThermPro done what, uh, what, what the meter and I forget what the other one uh, couldn't do, which was get the range from my shack to in my office. Now, I don't know the uh, footage on that, but probably about two, 300 feet or something. And uh, sure as hell, they have. I mean, I got a, uh, I got a clear connection here. The ambient temp is 194 and my uh, steak is moving up to that 110 range. So I'm going to get out there and um, pull that off and then sear it off. But I have to tell you, man, that so far I am extremely impressed. Again, the other ones couldn't do it. This one seems to do it. And, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to diving into this app and taking this a little bit further, man. Let me get outside and let me pull that steak off and let's sear it off. So look, that wasn't long at all. I guess probably even under a half hour. We climbed up. We are probably a 113, 114 internal. We will let that sit. We will fire up our uh, infrared. And as you can see, we are off the charts. Probably about a thousand degrees Fahrenheit right on that surface right there. We will get that steak on. It'll flame up. You know the deal. We will flip it and we will bring it to the board. Yeah. I mean, 
and I can tell you, man, once those juices kind of hit that flame, man, that didn't take long. That is getting nice and crisped up, man. That is flavor. All right, guys, look, man, as mentioned, as you could see that char on that steak, this isn't really about the steak, although, hell, man, it is going to be good eats. Let's turn it over live, get some closing thoughts. Yeah. All right, guys, look, when I say low production value, that is what I mean. And look, I am not even going to cut this steak open. It is not about the steak. It is about the temp spike from Therm Pro. And has the temp spike from Therm Pro done what these have failed to do? And that is basically reach from my shack all the way into the house, into my office, so I can monitor my long cooks from in there. And yes, my friends, it has. So look, man, I gotta say, I'm, 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 I'm pretty impressed, man. I was definitely into one of these other ones, but again, man, if I can't monitor what I'm smoking from in my office, it is definitely a no-go for me. Well, I am real interested in moving forward with this thing and really just putting it through its paces and diving into that app to see just how good it is. So look, man, that is it for this one. I'll leave information down below, and I do believe I have a 10% off. If you've been wanting to dive into one of these uh, wireless thermometers, this one definitely may be the right one for you. Check out the links I have in my description, and that is it. Until next time, we will see you soon.